WISN 12 editorial with President and General Manager Jan Wade. After years of planning, Milwaukee just launched its first ever bus rapid transit line. The highly anticipated BRT called Connect One promises riders a faster and greener option. The new battery electric buses operate along a nine mile east west corridor on a dedicated bus lane between the Milwaukee Regional Medical Center in Wauwatosa and Van Buren in Wisconsin on the east end of downtown. With a price tag of $55 million of mostly federal funds, the BRT aims to revolutionize public transit by offering faster, reliable, and convenient service. It also alleviates traffic congestion, reduces emissions, and improves access to jobs, education, and recreation all along the route. Connect One has 16 bus stations in each direction. Each one has a ticket machine to avoid lines. Each seat has a USB charging outlet for a more modern experience. And during peak hours, Connect One offers service every 10 minutes. And that feels like a big leap forward for the city of Milwaukee. Plus, it's free until the end of September. The biggest challenge for the BRT right now, it seems, is for those of us driving cars to get the hang of the new dedicated bus lanes. Hopefully that will come with practice and time. But unfortunately, there is a much more critical hurdle down the road for the city's new rapid transit system. That's the fiscal budget crisis looming for the city and county in 2025. Milwaukee's entire bus system could face major cuts due to a $26.5 million budget shortfall, and that would certainly derail the progress and positivity of the new BRT line and many other vital services unless a revenue solution is found. My fingers are crossed. I'm Jan Wade.